Make sure you stand till the end guys, we'll share common mistakes people make that can cost you thousands of dollars in damages. Stay with us, we'll explain what we're talking about. Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Ford Escape, that generation from year 2013 to year 2019. If you guys have one of those, if you need to find where the turbocharger by bypass valve fuse is located, which fuse you need to check, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste your money and time. What's well, important, guys, to always test fuses and relays. All that will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure you stay until the end. So before we start, let us tell you a little bit about us, guys. If you have that generation Ford Escape from year 2013 to 2019, this specifically is pre-facelifted version, this is the facelifted version. There will be some minor differences, we'll talk about that, but we'll make a video about every single possible fuse, relay, why we do that. Let's say, guys, you're down the road in the middle of nowhere, you need to find where the fuse for fuel pump or engine starter is located, or relay for radiator fan, you can just search that on our channel, watch the video for less than one or two minutes find out where it is replace it in your back on the road we do that to save you money guys every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos why we guys do that because our mission here at the shop is to save you as much money as we can and we guys have more than 12,000 free repair videos on our youtube channels as well that can save you more than thousands of dollars in future repairs if you guys need to buy any parts tools fuses relays at a good price quick shipping that way you do not waste your money and time we will share the links in the description of the video below for your convenience make sure you stay until the end so the turbocharger bypass valve fuse where you can find it on that ford escape here this is the pre-facelifted version this is the facelifted version but it should work guys actually on both so uh, you guys have three different fuse boxes in that suv and today we'll be working okay in just one of them and it's right under the hood Open the hood facing the engine guys, here on the right side you have a fuse box under this cover here, open it and you will find the main engine fuse box with a layout like this one. Before we continue let's explain why it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys when all you have to do test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out the turbocharger bypass valve which fuse you need to check now for that ford escape on that ford escape if you need to buy guys new turbochargers bypass valves fuses relays parts at a good price quick shipping we'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can find that and save quite a bit of money here that front section of the fuse box faces the front of your ford escape this is the windshield side passenger side driver side if we zoom in and we come in that front section here, the fuse that we need to check is known as fuse number 34, guys. And that fuse, okay, will be right here. That 10 m fuse, okay, right there. That's fuse number 34. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. 